T Mac, how you doing, man? What up, dog? Hey, um, as, as you know, I'm sure it's Kobe's last game tomorrow. Is, is it? <laughs> and uh, it's Kobe's uh, last game. Would, would you take it easy on him, or would you play harder against him? Hell if, no, because it was all the way around. He wouldn't take it easy on me. No. You got to try to destroy him. Yeah. All the people he's destroyed in his career, this is your opportunity to try to destroy him. Do you think Kobe will cry on, in his last game? What are the odds he's going to shed talking, a tear? You know what? I was I was talking about somebody today about that. Yeah. Uh, I think at halftime, man, if they do a uh, if they do a tribute to him, or after the game when he has to grab the mic and just feel all the love that he's been getting over this this season, yeah, I, I think he'll shed a tear. You think so? Rightfully so, though, because I mean, he, man's phenomenal, man. You know, 20 years, one team, all the accomplishments individually. Uh, one of the most fierce competitors to play our game. Um, you know, I would love to see that emotion just go ahead and pour out because he's he's been just so fierce and just nasty on the basketball court. Yeah. Uh, I I love to see it all just just pour out. Yeah, all right. Uh, this is a hypothetical. You know, the Warriors are going for 73 tomorrow. Kobe's last game. You can only buy tickets to one. Which one do you do? Well, I play. I competed against Kobe for years, so I, I want to witness history. Something that's never been done. That's 73 wins. Nice. All right, guys. Tracy, what, what did you think? What was going through your mind when Robert Ory uh, burned you today? Did he burn me? Well, it, you know, with the ring thing. People are going crazy about it on the internet. Listen, man. It was a joke. Really, it was a joke. I mean, I, I can understand how people take things, but I'll say this. Anybody can be a champion. Everybody can't be a Hall of Famer. All right. Thank you, T-Mac. Have a good night, man.